All right, so form three. Form three opens today. You have, as with the other forms, one week to do your original posts. You then actually have a little bit more time to do your ratings because otherwise the due date would be on Thanksgiving. So you actually will have until the following Tuesday, the Tuesday after Thanksgiving to do your ratings. So let's take a look at form three. I want you to find an interesting novel, non-standard input or output device or technique. So don't show me a keyboard from the 1980s. Don't show me a keyboard I see every day here. There's got to be something new about it if you're going to choose a keyboard. Don't limit yourself to keyboards. And trackballs are not new and novel, by the way. I know. All right, I want you to find a device, discuss its intended audience, its usability, accessibility, and cognitive features, and include all of that information very neatly so it's easy for me to read and grade in your post. Now, what do I mean by a novel input device? Oh, and you have to include a link as usual. I want to see it. Well, one of the more popular novel input devices, won't be novel after probably another year since they're coming out more and more, are 3D printers. Have you guys seen 3D printers? Do you know how many types of 3D printers there are, there are out there? Sorry? There are actually quite a number of them. I actually don't know how many. So what I'm actually going to show you is a 3D printer. This happens to be one kind of 3D printer. I want you to find something. Fun like this. All right, so something that is really not common. Now, I especially want to see what you can find because as 3D printers are becoming more popular, the, I, think, um, I think it's in December, the first commercial one that's already put together for you is supposed to be released, if I recall correctly. I can't remember the, the name of the, the company. Because these days you can get one, but you usually have to kind of put them together unless you're going to pay a couple thousand 
you know, a couple thousand dollars for one. So I'm going to be looking to you guys to help me find something new and novel to show students in the future. Aren't you excited? You can influence all of the newbies. All right, so what I would want you to do is, of course, include a link, talk about who is the intended audience, what would they do about it, talk some things about the usability, accessibility, and those sorts of things. Now, here's the obvious thing that everyone should get. Do not give me a link to the same type of 3D printer. I've showed you in class. It's not novel anymore. There are other types. There are more advanced types. If you can find them, and that's what you're into, I'll not give you any more hints than that, then you can. But there is a lot of really cool stuff out there. So that's what I want you to do. Find it. It can be input or output. And create a post for the future generations to see.